Hello, this is Professor Grant Thrall. Welcome to Geography 3602, as well as the graduate student listing for Urban and Business Geography, also known as GIS for Business and Marketing Geography. The purpose of this course is to introduce you, the student, to the basic geographical technology that we use in business geography. If this is your first course in business geography, well, then that's great. There are no prerequisites uh, for this course. Business geography uh, is the geospatial component of business managerial decisions. Business geography explanation, prediction, and most importantly, judgment and following judgment management of the consequences of the decisions that have been made. Uh, our course objectives are to learn the geospatial technology, to learn how to work with the geospatial data, as well as to find the geospatial data. Uh, we're going to see examples in the course on geospatial in business. The uh, College of Business awards a degree in business with a specialization in business and marketing geography and the Department of Geography awards a certificate in business geography. The exercises in the course will account for 30% of the grade. The exams, which are the midterm and the final, together will comprise 35% of the grade. The semester project will be 20% of the grade. And your attendance and participation in both the live lectures and the online forum will account for 15%. Uh, the materials that you will need is the Maptitude GIS software. You can look at that software overview at caliper.com, C-A-L-I-P-E-R.com. Uh, you're also required to have a laptop computer capable of executing Maptitude. Uh, I personally have uh, an Alienware laptop from uh, Dell computer and it is really great but you don't need a computer that powerful but GIS is very intensive. Faster and more is better when you're dealing with GIS. Most laptop computers but not netbooks. Most laptop computers will do an adequate job for this course. But look at the specifications of re minimum requirements on the uh, caliper.com website. Uh, so you'll need Microsoft Office, particularly uh, Excel, PowerPoint, and Word. And also you'll need to have internet access with high bandwidth. Teamwork. Working with others is highly recommended. It's encouraged. But on the exams, on any material to be graded, you're on the University of Florida Honor Code, and that must be on your own. Getting started. Log on to your e-learning account download and review the course syllabus for Geography 3602 and also immediately purchase Maptitude and Miller's book. You can buy you have buy Miller's book from Amazon.com or any other online retailer. Find a, uh, uh, the best price and the, the best service that uh, matches your preferences but get it quickly. I advise against purchasing a used copy because Miller's book includes a run a version of ArcMap GIS which will last you for the semester and then switch off. If you buy a used book it does not come with ArcMap. Aptitude is becomes your software program. Your it's available at a very special low price and it's your software program just like Microsoft Word would be yours if you purchase. Do not load Maptitude on more than one computer because the license will then, upon detecting it's been loaded on a second computer, will switch off both licenses. Learning modules, all of the lectures have been automated and are accessible via the e-learning system for Geography 3602. You are responsible for reviewing all the reading materials, all of the viewing materials in sequence. And you're also responsible for homework lab assignments, exams, and the semester project. 
they must be submitted to the e-learning system for this course and each has their own unique deadline. It's your responsibility to know when the deadline occurs and to meet that deadline. Late submissions are not accepted. Attendant. This is a hybrid internet course. Most of your class participation will be via the internet. However, live lectures will occur, and they are to your benefit that we do meet collectively upon occasion. Live lectures will be announced, and you are required to attend. You are required to check regularly your email accounts three times a day, I recommend. And if you miss an announcement and you do not attend a live lecture, then you will receive a, a negative points for that day online forum participation that's important for learning the material helping others learn the material and learning how to professionally engage if you behave as a guru uh, in a very positive helpful manner your grade will positively reflect that as well special accommodation students requesting special accommodation must first register with the dean of students office the dean of students office then provides the documentation to the student who then must present that documentation uh, to me uh, and, uh, and what the nature of the special accommodation is. The semester topics are that we're going to first uh, get going on geospatial analysis to understand what geospatial analysis is, what is the technology, and how the technology can improve the business decision. Second is we're going to be looking at data and how to make data geospatial. 85% of what we do is data and 85% of all data is geospatial. We will understand the technology behind understanding customers. Uh, we in geospatial analysis look at people and the context their marginal propensity to consume and we have data on the segments of the population and how they divide up by their marginal propensity to consume. We call that lifestyle segmentation profiles and also psychographics. Uh, we will learn about spatial decision strategies, SDS, calculation of trade areas, calculation of market penetration, and calculation of the demographic composition within the relevant trade areas. We will learn how to generate prospect lists and as well as identify investment opportunities from property data. The sixth is the enterprise solution. We will look at integrated marketing and segmenting geospatial data. Seven, profiling our customers by LSP and their property characteristic. We will spend a fair amount of time on the property assessment data files which most counties in the United States and increasingly the world has available. Uh, globalization uh, will learn how to get information onto Google Earth and Google Maps and thereby reach the global market. And nine, the human built environment to identify where the hot spots are and where the cool spots are where the investment opportunities are great and where the risk might be greater than the benefits received from the investment. Ten is retail site selection. We'll look at uh, the distribution of places, retail places, and how their trade areas may overlap. They're solving for a proper distribution of multi-branch retailers. Eleven is management of sales territories using postal geography, census geography, government geography, and even creating your own geography. And 12 is the semester project. Uh, throughout the semester, you will be creating uh, lab exercises, and this is an opportunity to put all of those exercises together with other materials that you might have, uh, and to tell me a story of, of a uh, a phenomena in Alachua County uh, that is geographic and that can be conveyed using the type of analysis and technology that you have learned in this